WTFNN. Headline News Update. Good morning, folks. Welcome to the, what is it? Today is the uh, September 18th market update. This is Steve Rhodes coming to you live from the shores of sunny Delray Beach, Florida. And currently we've got a mixed bag market out there. You've got the Dow up five points, the S&P up four, NASDAQ 112, Russell's off five, semis are up eight, Trendy's up 16, New York Stock Exchange off 14 points, gold's up two bucks, silver's off seven pennies, Lights we crude is up nearly a dollar, trade out at 90.96, natural gas is up eight pennies, she traded at 273 in the 30 year treasury down five ticks, printed out at 118.14. Let's figure out what all that means by looking at that nine panel market update chart. We begin the upper left hand corner of the ES mini. What we have right now is just a good old fashioned consolidation with inside its daily profiles. You've got support down at the area of 44.17 to 44.24. That's the daily and weekly bottom of its profile out there. Spot volatilities is uh, so far today it's tested and rejected the 50 day exponential moving average. The 50 days printed at 1477, the high today 1475. If price closed above 1477 and then does that for two consecutive sessions, that would indicate to me that the ES mini would go target that support level in that 4417, 4424 area. The NASDAQ, uh, the NQ, it closed below the bottom of its daily profile on Friday. It's trading below that today, it being 15.489. A second consecutive close below 15.489 would suggest to move down to the bottom of its weekly profile, and that's at 15.191. The U.S. dollar index is strong like bull, no topping pattern in place. Price remains above the top of its daily profile. As long as that takes place, and that's at 104.78. Expect the U.S. dollar index to move higher. If we take a look at gold, gold is consolidating with inside its daily profile. It formed a TD9 count bottom that completes that pattern today. It confirmed that pattern on Friday. But you've got a consolidation with inside its profile levels. Sellers hanging out at 1954.60 and buyers at 1928.30. Silver formed a TD9 count pattern as well. It's taking on the bottom of its daily profile, 23.32. A close above that, a second consecutive close, should take us up to 23.74. Now, Lightsweed Crude has got an A to B equals CD pattern. That should take us to the initial price projection is 96.70. Now, that retracement level on the B to C leg is only 32%. That says really what this should do is more than a one-to-one -one move to the upside for light speed crude. If we take a look at natural gas, you've just got a good old-fashioned consolidation between daily profile levels of 253 up at the bottom or down at the bottom and 282 up at the uh, top. And the 30-year Treasury testing support, it's bullish structured daily profile at 118.03. Folks, stay tuned for the Trader's Edge show, but if you have to start your Monday. Please have a magnificent one. We'll look forward to speaking with you again soon. Take care now.